Okay, all right, folks. Welcome to the webinar. The uh, if you haven't seen this video uh, that I've just posted here on the chat box, you can go ahead and uh, watch it. What we are looking at here is how to trade the SPX intraday. So in this particular case, what we are using is the ticks. If you look at the ticks, this is real time. Every time a stock ticks up or down, it goes into the tick value. So there is nothing more fundamental or more uh, uh, body case. It's the lowest denominator of, uh, of, the, of the market internal. The moment you see two persistent dots and you also see the, the custom RSI uh, also built in, that's when you want to go for the trade. Now, this is a custom indicator as well, uh, the, uh, the custom RSI. Usually, when you look at the RSI, you'll say that, okay, if it goes above the higher line, then it is overbought. Or, or if you go below the lower line, then it is uh, you know, oversold. In this case, that's not the case. The more time re it remains above in the overbought, that means you, we need to stay in the trade. You need to stay in the trade. So this is a great example of when you would stay in the trade, uh, especially even if you see some two, three dots over here, uh, you can see, but the RSI is completely, uh, you know, above the 60 level. And so you want to stay in the trade right there. And so this keeps you in the trade for much longer. And you would probably stay in the trade all the way towards the close. And, uh, you know, perhaps, uh, you know, uh, get down, uh, get out of it when you see these one or two dots. And, or if this guy, uh, the RSI slips below the 60 level. So there is much more uh, customization involved in this. Uh, the settings are 60-40 on the RSI.